wanted to catch you guys up on what we've been up to. Yeah, so pretty much me and Kayla have been busy all week. We've pretty much been packing our house and selling everything because we are moving again. So when we bought our house, we did buy it with the thought that we are eventually going to rent it out. And we didn't really plan on doing it this soon, but it, everything just kind of worked out. So I don't know how much really we shared, but before we moved down to Arizona, we sold almost everything that we owned and just filled up our little five-seater mini SUV and drove to Arizona. And we just had what was in our car. And so the things that we've accumulated since we've been in Arizona are just things that we've bought or people have given to us um, since we've been down here. And so, yeah, we were really fortunate to get by with pretty little, um, but we did sell everything. And now we're back down to just about one car load worth of stuff. So we've been in Arizona for like about a year and uh, we've got to experience like the winters here, which are amazing. I absolutely love the winters. We'll probably be back next winter because I love them so much. It's like 70 degrees like all day and it's like sunny. It's nothing like Seattle, but um, there's also the summer, which is in a couple months and I can tolerate the heat, but it gets, it gets pretty hot over here. It gets like 100, 110. Last summer, um, it got all the way up to like 113, which like broke some. Records. It was 118. Or something like that. It but, was crazy. Um, a, the summers are a big reason we actually kind of want to move at least for a couple months. So we're going to be going to Idaho for the summertime and we'll see what happens after that. So we don't really have a lot of plans that are set in stone. Yeah, like I said, we're just, we're selling everything. We're putting our house up for rent and um, we're gonna go stay between my parents and Gabe's parents' house. We wanna kind of be with family and have the kids be with our cousins, um, at least for the summer. And then I feel like at the end of summer, we're just gonna kind of reassess what we're doing and where we love to be and figure it out from there. <laughs> okay guys, our house is all empty. Do you wanna give us a tour yeah. of our house? And Are you ready? Yep. Okay, let's go inside. So this is the laundry room where everything used to be. So here's the bathroom. It's ours. Mm. And everything's empty. My huge bed was like here to here. Uh -huh, that's right. That was so huge. Can you dance move in here? Yeah. Something I loved about our room that was that it was so big and we just had a tiny little bed so our bed was like this tiny little thing over here and we had a chair and a nice big rug. It was just open, wasn't it? Yeah. I really like the high ceilings too. The high ceilings are awesome. Yeah. yeah. Next up is the living room where, where a lot of stuff used to be. And this is the kitchen. Yep. Now we're going to go out and say bye to the house now guys, okay? I feel like we've pretty much converted to like minimalist scale. Like we yeah. only have enough stuff to kind of get us by and we don't have anything extra. So it's, I feel like it's kind of nice to like sell all our stuff again and go back to like bare bones. But like the place we're moving to is really small for, for the month before we go to Idaho. So like we're probably gonna fill it fill it up with like all our stuff, even though we don't have a lot. I don't know about you, Gabe, but I feel like I was really attached to physical things um, before we started this whole process of coming down to Arizona. And I feel like now I feel so free every time we get rid of stuff. Cause it's like, I just feel like I'm not tied down by things. And it's, it's so, I don't know what it is, refreshing. I don't... Hello everybody. So we have now been out of our old house for a couple of days and we've been into the new place that we're staying in for a couple of days. Let me just remind you that the house that we lived in was about 1200 square feet and this little space that we're living in is about half that. It's pretty much the size of a one bedroom apartment, which we are super, super grateful and thankful for, um, but it is a lot smaller than we're used to. So when we moved in here and we like put our, all of our stuff down in the living room, oh my goodness, it was such a mess. There was stuff literally everywhere and it was so overwhelming because it was like where do we even put all this stuff because the um, apartment was already 
fully furnished and it had everything like towels and all that stuff and we brought all of our own things so needless to say it was a mess but here it is a few days later we've kind of gotten everything tucked away we have everything stored away so that we can function and it's really cute and we're really thankful to have a place to stay for this month so let me go ahead and show you our little place our little home for the next month Okay, so we're just gonna walk in here. All right, we have our own little entrance, which is so perfect for us. And like I said, it's just a little space, but it works out so well. You can see, let's see if I can kind of show you from behind me. We have like this little, we have this little kitchen. This is the door that connects to the um, main part of the house that we are not staying in. So um, anyways, we have the kitchen, which is small, but it works perfectly for us. It has everything we need. We have like the fridge, we have a dishwasher. We have like a small little stove top thing. Um, a hot plate, is that what it's called? <laughs> anyways, we have everything we absolutely need. And yeah, you can see we have this little living room space. And then down the hall here, there is one bedroom and a bathroom. So we're making it work. I will say something that I'm really going to miss about Arizona is all of these citrus fruits. Can you see all the grapefruits? We have some oranges from a local orange stand. Oh my goodness, and these are huge. Can you see how big this is? The grapefruit, it's like as big as my head. <laughs> Anyways, um, and you can see like we obviously have things just sitting here. We have some cooking stuff. We obviously have the piano. We have our shoes, obviously the Barbie house. Um, things, not everything is gonna have a space. Um, since our place is so tiny here, but it works well for us. So needless to say, this next month or two, just life coming up in general is going to be really exciting for us. We're gonna have a lot of things happening. Um, so if you haven't already subscribed, make sure and do so so you can see our adventure. And thanks for watching, bye.